Okay, this is a quick repasso review of conocer and saber. And then the directions with the assignment are also on this video. So I hope that you're watching. It goes like this. We're going to start with conocer. Conocer to know people and places. Conozco, conoces, conoce, conoce, conoce. Conocemos, conocéis, conocen, conocen, conocen. We know that we use conocer when you're saying you know a person, like I know your mother, he knows the teacher, or when you know a place, like you're familiar with a place. For example, we know Richland Mall, um, the boy lives in Oklahoma, he knows Oklahoma. Saber, the little chant goes this way, saber, to know information and how to say Sabes, sabe, 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 sabemos, sabes, saben, saben, saben. We know from our notes yesterday that you use saber when you know information. And that could be information about a person. For example, if you want to say, I know Senora Wilson, that's just knowing a person. Conozco a la Senora Wilson. But if you know something about me, like I know Senora Wilson um, doesn't wear her mask when she makes these videos, then that I know would not be conozco. That would be yo sé que that La Señora Wilson no se pone la máscara durante los videos. You also use saber when you know how to do something. For example, we know how to skate. Sabemos patinar. All right, so here are the directions for today's work. It says, fill in the blank with the correct form of conocer. So, conozco, conoces, conoce, or saber. Se, make sure you remember that one has an accent. Sabe, 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 whatever. And then justify and tell me why you picked the verb you picked. For example, number one, it says the boy knows how to swim. So I should be able to see right here that it says how to. So a how to situation obviously is saber. The boy is not over here. He's singular. I picked sabe. So I filled in the blank with sabe. I made it red and underlined it because I know Senora is old and can't see well. And then I justify and say, hey, I picked that because it was a how to situation. These right here are going to be your four justifications. It's either going to be knowing people or places for conocer, or it's going to be knowing information or how to with saber. I actually did three examples for you. The next one says, I know your mother. All right, that's just a flat out knowing a person. That's my justification. Or you can put people, I don't care. Since it's in the yo form, conozco is your verb choice. Now, the next one I specifically put on here so you can see the difference between I know your mother, who is a person, and knowing something about your mother. I know that your mother is my aunt, okay? I didn't say I knew her. I mean, probably you do, but that's not important. You know something about her. So that right there is knowing information. Now, it is information about a person, but it's still information. That's why this one is the yo form se, and this one where you're just saying you know a person is conozco. So there are 10 of these for you to do. Basically, all you have to do is fill in the correct verb form and then the justification with person, place, information, or how to. Buena suerte. This is going to count probably as a quiz grade. Adios.